In this video, I'm gonna show you how to do a correct UV mapping according to the form of your model using Pass Deform and UVW Map modifier. Let's dive in! Hello everyone, I'm Said Mandegar. Welcome back to another tutorial. For those who are new in here, I'm so excited to have you, and for those who are along with me through the year, I'm glad to talk to you again. Here you see I made a spline using the line tool to apply my model on it, cause the best way to do this correction is to use a spline rather than an extruded object. Let's draw a box, as tall as the wall or the arc should be. You can also change the size later. Now type the pass deform twice, cause the first one is another modifier that we are not after. Then press pick path and select the spline. If it's in the wrong axis, change it here. By changing the person's amount, you can lead the spline on the model to get shaped. Here we have two things to consider. First, the segment number should be at maximum to give you the best result. If you decrease it, it gives you more edges. If you are after such a shape, that's fine. Reduce it as much as you want. Now let's assign the material and do the rest of the settings. Sounds the axis is correct, but the ratio is distorted. So I add a UVW map modifier to control it. Now you see the ratio is ok, but the axis is incorrect. Let me rotate the gizmo to fix this problem. That looks better, but still not perfect. The second note is, you have to bring down the UVW map modifier below the path deform. And now, as you see, it looks perfect. Let's do some more on the model to make it look more realistic. And the magic happens with chamfer modifier. I 
I control its amount so the edges no more will be sharp and it feels like a real brick. Well, here I set up the scene and prepare it for my final render. And there we go. This is the result. As you see, materials follow the form very well. And the chamfer did a very good job on the edges. I use a very high quality and tileable texture which you can download them by following the download path I put in the description tab. Please like this video if you like it and subscribe to my channel and click on that bell to be notified about the next videos. See you soon. Have fun.